If for some reason you've looked at medals in The Sims 4 and thought, yes, I must have them, then you've come to the right place. They're like fancy rocks, so you know you're in for a good time, somehow. We're going to look at completing the medal collection, in which there are 20 in the base game and a further two brought in from the Get to Work expansion pack. Now looking firstly at the base game, the main way to find medals is to head out and look for rocks speckled with gold and silver and dig them up. These have a decent chance of giving you a metal, but you might also be given MySim trophies or treasure maps. Honestly, it is a rather slow process and you'll need to keep exploring new worlds and areas, digging up lots of rocks to find more metals. The good news is that if you have the Get to Work expansion pack, then the metal collection becomes much easier to complete, with many more ways to collect metals becoming available. Firstly, if you enter into the scientist career, then the active career work lot will have heaps of rock spawns all placed very closely together, meaning it's super easy to constantly dig for metals and collect them at a much faster rate. If you're in the career, then you can also chat to co-workers and ask them for a medal, which they'll often happily comply. Yes, the scientists are very giving people and we love that for us. At level 5 in the scientist's career, you can also create the cloning machine, which you can use to make copies of any medals that you already have in seconds. Get to Work also brings a chemical analyzer, and you can analyze metals on this rather drab looking machine. This has a chance to give you another metal without consuming the one that you analyze. Note that you can only analyze a metal once, and any metals obtained from analyzing can't be analyzed themselves. Get to Work also brings with it Alien Sims, and aliens will have the power to transmute crystals, metals, and elements, turning them into a random crystal, metal, or element. This can be a great way to turn extra crystals or elements into metals, but note that aliens will have a cooldown and they can only transmute objects around every 4 hours. It should also be noted that if your sim reaches level 10 of the scientist's career, then they can unlock the Alien Aura Serum. Drinking this will give your sims an 8 hour focus plus 3 moodlet, and during this time, your sims will have access to alien powers without any cooldown, meaning you can transmute crystals, metals, and elements repeatedly to hopefully get more metals from the collection. And of course, another perk from the Get to Work expansion pack is that you can access and get to the secret alien homeworld of 6am. The easiest way to travel there is to buy and build a rocket ship, get to level 10 of the rocket science skill, and install the wormhole generator on your rocket. 6M is also the only place where your sims can find the plutonium and solarium metals, which are added in with the Get to Work expansion pack. Now if you have the Seasons expansion pack, then medals can sometimes appear after a thunderstorm, and if you have the Island Living expansion pack, then if you activate the Volcanic Activity Lot Challenge, then sometimes the Volcanic Boulders which fall from the sky can provide you with medals as well. If you have the Realm of Magic Gang pack, then some medals will also be on sale at the questionable Quacks Emporium in Caster's Alley. Note that this store won't sell every type of medal. Finally, if you're close to completing the medal collection and you have another sim who has the medal that you need, then you can consider having that sim gift the needed medal to your sim. This is a great method if you're missing one or two medals from the collection and you know another sim has it, but note that you will need the Seasons expansion pack to be able to give gifts. Medals will provide an environment boost when placed in rooms, and when you complete the medal collection, you'll be given the Magnum Ingot Plaque, which is just a little bit cute. And we've reached the end, that's how to collect medals in The Sims 4. That's right, run out and grab your shiny rocks, that's what I'll be doing. If you enjoyed or found this helpful, then please subscribe and leave a like, I would really appreciate it, and have an amazing day. See you later!